So I'm here in Dallas, Texas for two days. There's a lot of places that I want to check out, but the first spot that I'm going to go to is all the sporting arenas that are here in Dallas, Texas. Both Globe Life Park and the AT&T Stadium are located in Arlington, Texas, which is about roughly 20 to 25 miles west of Dallas. Although the American Airlines Center mainly houses the Dallas Mavericks, it's also home to a whole bunch of concerts that may be going on in Dallas, major concerts. While in Dallas, I noticed that there were a lot of train stations just uh, spread out across the city. So I did some research over it and it turns out that Dallas has a very complex and successful uh, transportation system through trains. The name of the train uh, structure is called DART. Now these train stations are spread out across uh, all of Dallas on the north, west, east, and south side. There's different kinds of trains. Some are called Green Line, Red Line, Orange Line, Blue Line. Some of these trains travel uh, west to east, east to west, north and south, uh, northwest to southwest, so on and so forth. And it is extremely affordable too. I think an all day pass was uh, $10 and you can use that same pass to ride uh, the Via bus or the city bus. I think if you're a student, you can also get an all day pass for, for a buck 50. So if you're ever here in Dallas, go for a train ride. Here in the medical district, there's a few major hospitals, uh, Parkland Hospital, UT Southwestern Hospital, Children's Hospital. Now, historical fact about this area is back in the 60s, whenever JFK was assassinated, he was rushed to this area, specifically Parkland Hospital. Mike Anderson's Barbecue. Mike Anderson's Barbecue is located in the medical district. Probably one of the best barbecue places in all of Dallas, Texas. All of the meats that they serve are hickory smoked, like chicken, turkey, brisket, sausage, ham. Their sides are homemade, green beans, mashed potatoes, and beans, and even their dessert is homemade as well. Now, if you, if you happen to be here in Dallas, Texas, this is definitely one of the best barbecue places to come to, but make sure that you come either between Monday and Saturday from 10 a.m. to 2.30 p.m. They're only open for four and a half hours.
So another spot that I went to go eat to while I was in Dallas was Waffle House. This is a 24-7 restaurant and they're spread all across Dallas. Waffle House was a pretty good spot. Their hash brown were delicious, waffles were amazing, good prices too. Waffle House is definitely known for their breakfast, but they also serve lunch and dinner. I really enjoyed Waffle House. Definitely a place you should check out if you're in the Dallas area. Also in the medical district, there was this great burger place that I went to go eat to called Maple and Motor. From the looks of it, it seems like this restaurant is family owned and everything is homemade as well. Burgers are a great size, great fries. They also serve brisket sandwiches and all sorts of other types of sandwiches. I ended up getting the bacon cheeseburger with fries and man oh man, was it good. By doing some uh, basic research about the places to go to in Dallas, I noticed that there was a zoo and an aquarium, so I'm gonna check both of those places out. One of the many places that you can come visit here in Dallas is the Dallas Zoo. Uh, very kid friendly place, great atmosphere, a lot of animals, super humongous place. at the Dallas World Aquarium. Fantastic place, very uh, jungle feeling. Now the Dallas World Aquarium has such a great variety of so many land creatures. 
and sea creatures, frogs, uh, snakes, crocodiles, spiders, birds, sharks, penguins, flamingos, so many fishes. It is highly recommended that you come here to the Dallas World Aquarium. Very great place for the kids and just a great scenery all together. downtown Dallas right now great scenery humongous place has a lot to offer good places to eat hotels apartments tall tall buildings uh, there's also a John F Kennedy Memorial here in downtown Dallas along with the Holocaust Museum that I went to when I was in Dallas was the Galleria Mall. The Galleria Mall is the biggest mall in all of Dallas, Texas. It's a four-story mall. The ground floor has the food court plus the ice skating rink. The first, second, and third floor are where all the department stores are at. So that about wraps it up for Dallas. I really, really, really enjoyed being in this city. This uh, <laughs> this city has a special place in my heart for sure. If you enjoyed watching this video, please go ahead and like my video, subscribe to my channel, and please go ahead and share my video. And I'll see you in the next city. <laughs>